William. Do you have a moment? Hast du Platz gewetzt gesehen? Schon wieder mit dieser Unsinn. Was sind los mit dieser Leute? trying for years to bring it up to working order. This is the first phase of the plan to gain access to sets underwater safe keep. Use the tunnel glider to find a way into the weapons depot in the Berlin catacombs. Anya has agreed to track your position over the transponder and provide tactical support. Good luck, Sir Blaskovich. These are deep waters. William, can you hear me? You have to make your way all the way through the sewer tunnels and into the Berlin catacombs. I'll try to guide you through. Oh? I thought somebody was standing here just now. What was that? Okay, Anya's gonna be guiding me. Do we know anything about this place? Absolutely not. <sighs> I don't know how you're gonna be guiding me, but okay. Yeah, for these little cubes, I can just make a really, really small hole, and that's okay. Awesome. If we're going into the water, that sounds kind of dangerous. Because what about breathing? Air? Oh! Did we put on a mask just now? The tunnel glider is an underground, underwater vehicle designed for navigating the Berlin sewer system. It is equipped with an onboard oxygen tank and breathing mask. Ah, okay. W and S. Oh, use mouse to steer. A and D to rotate the tunnel glider. Ah, okay. This is a little bit different from walking normally. Kind of got to get used to it. Because otherwise, we're going to lose track of what's up and what's down pretty quickly. Is there a glass encasing this thing? No, we're just sort of wearing a mask, I guess. The old sewer tunnels beneath Berlin have been neglected for years. The Kreisau Circle used it to gain access to different parts of the city. Clever. So it's not the first time we've used it. That's good to know. A lot of recordings here this time. Hmm. You might have to exit the tunnel glider to neutralize obstacles in your way. Don't lose track of the tunnel glider. It's your only source of oxygen. Okay. Oh, is there a split path here? Oh. Oh, there's sort of something glowing there. Mm, but we can't get past this, right? So I guess we'll just go over here for now. I was a kid, and the red tide was rising. Went in the water on account of disobeying father. Felt like my skin was on fire. Like my skin was on fire. Was just wondering if we could hear anyone speak here. You 
You are right underneath the Eisenwald prison now. Caroline told me a few inmates tried to escape through the sewer system with some valuables a few years ago. They didn't make it very far. Ooh. Another chain? Oh, whoa. Some kind of statue here. Ah, oh, it's too far away. Some areas might be too narrow for the tunnel glider. You may have to swim. Is that area too narrow? I don't think so. Oh, it is. I thought I saw a chain back here too. Maybe not? We probably can't reach it anyway. Whoa. Thirteen years old. From the pond by the stables. Came up covered in leeches. Crazy. Filthy leeches. Oh, without the glider. I don't think we have oxygen. We're fading a little bit. <sighs> okay, I gotta get a hang of how to freaking drive this thing. I keep trying to drive it like I'm normally walking. William, I have something I want to tell you. I've been reading this diary my grandmother gave me. It's my cousin Ramona's diary. She used to work with us at the asylum. She's dead now, but... She had many secrets inside of her, and there was no one she could trust to keep them. So she wrote them all down. I will radio the diary entries to your audio lock. If you find the time, you can listen. Sure. Just wondering where we are now. Uh, does that sort of go back to the blocked place? It's in Polish, but I'll translate. Ramona writes, May 11th, 1940. I've only been back home for three days, and now the Nazis have arrived in town. They killed Jakub Brozek. He was shot in the head. His horse was blocking the road. He taught me how to French kiss. I'm going to do something about this situation. That was such a short audio dialogue. But again, aside from the cutscenes and stuff, like this is such a meticulously done audio log. In addition to this picture here, you can hear that the quality is not so good because it's Anya talking to you over the headset and she's flipping the pages as she's reading it too. I'm just sort of baffled at how how much care was put into the cutscenes and the sound design and the world building. It's just really not quite what I expect out of a shooter. If I want to go to the um, blocked place, should I be going this way? No. I should be going the other way. Still learning how to drive here. Oh, but it's blocked here. It's blocked. Ah. Uh. Oh, I thought it might be connected here, but I guess not. All right. I don't think we have infinite oxygen here. So let's get a uh, move on. Is it all right for me to appear above a little bit? This is not where we're trying to go, right? Even though we have a door and everything. If there's any collectibles in the water, I think it'll be really easy to miss it, unfortunately. The section you are in now, it's been out of commission for a long time, but some machinery might still be manually operable. Like the the pump wheels here? Manually operable.
Mm hmm I wonder why we didn't bring a gun with us. Oh, we did. All right. Ah, uh, there's a little opening here, so we want to aim that down. But there's another wheel right behind that. Do we have to position both at the same time? Water wheel. Broken down and derelict machinery, like this water pumping system, is not unusual in these parts of the Berlin sewers. There might be another station in between the two wheels, I'm hoping, because otherwise, we'd have to go back and forth. Swam many water in my days. Feeling as cold as this. You're not just talking about the temperature, are you? That one we can't quite get past. Oh. Actually, if you want me to go here... That one's really close to being in the right spot, though. I wonder if it's worth me just going back and trying again. Because this one's pretty squarely in the spot where we can reach the other side. But that one... Just a tad more. It might end up being like a secret or something. Or maybe I'm just trying too hard, but you never know until you try. Didn't seem like there was another lever over there though, so we gotta do it here. I think we might be good now. Remember, we don't have the mask here. We're just swimming. Yeah. Now it's right in the middle. Can we go anywhere nice? Or do we want to go here? Oh. I'm losing my bearings. It's very spinny here. We're sort of going backwards? Which I think is a good thing. It mean, means we're not going forward. <laughs> well, yeah, of course, but I mean, that's probably a bigger indication that it's a secret, as opposed to moving forward. Oh, could we climb up here? Because that door is open. Is it really not possible for us to get up? If we go here or... We can't climb up the rock? Really? Why would they let me come here, then? Yeah, like, uh... Right here, we're just missing this one little spot, and you can see the freaking door opening. Really? Okay, well, it doesn't seem like we can go here, unfortunately. That door is telling me to go over there, though. Hmm... Bit of a shame, but I don't see a way past here, so I guess that's that. Uh, that's the way where we came from. This is something else. Hmm? Gold snake. Oh, now it's connected! Oh, I guess that's what we came back here for. Okay, cool. My job is done. I gotta just stop rotating. When I rotate, I get so confused. 
Mm -hmm. Now that we're back here, we get out of the section again and turn to the left. Which we can't do with the tunnel glider. The deep basin was used to regulate overflow. You will have to find a way to reach the platform on the other side. Ah, we want to increase the water levels so we can get the glider over. Is this the door I was looking at previously? Bomb raid on Berlin, March 17, 1943. An RAF bomb raid damaged multiple residential quarters in central Berlin last night. The raid caused large fires, with some witnesses describing a sea of flames engulfing several houses. Early reports indicate that a dozen civilians have been killed and scores more badly injured. Several people have also been reported as missing after seeking shelter from the bombs. That was right in the middle of the war, quite a while ago. Nope. Look for some mechanism to fill the basin with water. It will have to be all the way to the top for you to swim across. Mm-hmm. We got the map, which is nice. May 12, 1940. The Nazis have taken over the police station. They're asking local people to volunteer for service. I'm going to volunteer. I'm going to find a way to kill them. This is Anya's cousin? The Nazis have instilled such hatred in someone who I assume normally doesn't kill. I'm going to find a way to kill them. Wow. You can imagine the kind of atrocities they were committing. That is an enigma code. How do we get over there? It's gotta be all the way at the top, right? Oh, I might drown. Am I gonna drown? Nope. But how do I get over there? <sighs> you can't convince me. I don't need that enigma code. I need it. I need it. At the very minimum, we can drive the glider here now, and oh, there's another door here. Good, good. But nothing else. Okay, could I just jump over here? Yeah, shortcut. So far, so good. This is the old sewer system. Does that mean the sewers don't work anymore? Because if it works, there should be... Oh, it's not fully at the top yet, is it? We can't get past here, or... Hold on. As I was saying, though, if, if these sewers are still functional, then I feel like we should be expecting to see maintenance workers and whatnot. Something to be careful about. But that doesn't seem to be a thing here. Well done, William. This is as far as the tunnel glider will take you. Through the last section, you will have to swim. The catacombs are close. May 18th, 1940. Daytime, I care for the sick working at the asylum. On the evenings, I go to town to prepare supper for the Nazis at the police station. They seem to trust me. I think I can lure one of them away. If I can get a Nazi alone, I think I can kill him. I have never killed anyone. I don't know how to fight or fire a weapon. I will have to be smart about it. I miss the university. Perhaps what I'm about to do will be a learning experience. Yeah, again, making someone who's never killed anybody think that they have to kill a Nazi. Do 
age 11, swam across Forney Lake on a bed over 10 soldiers. It wasn't as dark as this. Again, not about the time of day, right? Force? Some kind of force? It's a wooden plate. Ah, uh, while we're swimming, we can't use any of the weapons. There's some platforms back there, so maybe we can think about that. Because otherwise... Oh! Okay, that's promising. Mm-hmm. It's one. Could we just push it or... Ah, the water current is automatically pushing it over there. Done. Don't even need two. Okay. Good. We need some air pretty badly though. Yeah, without the glider. That's something we'll have to be a bit more conscious about. June 25, 1940. The Nazi appears to have a very high opinion of his mother. I learned this as he was bleeding to death at the end of my knife in the outhouse next to the bakery. Muti, Muti, he whimpered. My hands were shaking, nearly dropped my knife. I had told him I would kiss him, and he let me lead him outside into the night. Wow. This activism, this spirit of activism runs in the family. That's it. Bullets. Nope. Okay. Whoa, it's really dark here. Some broken pipes down here. Seems like there might be a path. Do I want to go there or do I want to go there? Oh, already? November 29th, 1940. The Nazi appears to love his sausage. I learned this as he kept on eating his supper, even though the cyanide must have ruined the flavor. His eyes rolled back, all white, yet he kept chewing. The cyanide I stole from my mother's cabinet. At times, I am struck with pangs of remorse, but then I think of Jakub Prozak. How is she getting away with this? She's preparing their food and they're dying from poisoning of the food. That's insane. Where is this? Oh, it's actually where we need to be. Uh, in that case, do we want to check out this one first? Maybe it leads to the same place. Page 32. Swam the cesspools beneath Death's Head's Axe Labs. But it wasn't as dirty as this. So you're a little bit older than 32? Yeah, it's two different ways to go to the same place. Oh? You just sort of look here. Okay.
the other way to come here would be the, uh, this, right? Do we want to check back just in case? And there's probably nothing here, but it doesn't hurt to check. A little dangerous, though, because we gotta be mindful of, um, the situation with the oxygen. Yeah, it's just water, right? There's not much back here. I don't think. Okay, well, uh, we don't have to turn around because of the oxygen. We'll just go straight up. Page 19. Dove down the well to salvage father's watch. But it wasn't as deep as this. Ooh. I wonder if military training covers being able to hold your breath for a little bit longer. But BJ's breath is pretty good. That probably has to do with just general fitness though. Do we want to go down there? It's pretty permanent. Oh. Then what was that? What was that hole? Can we even come back up if we go down? I guess we're finding out now. Oh, this is back in the, um, the place we saw from the grates. All for this. <laughs> oh, and this. Lunula. Haven't looked at it for a while. How do these look? Oh, look at how many we missed. The water. Water is a hard place to keep track of these things. And get out here. Good, good. Weapons depot? <laughs> Excellent, Captain Blaskovich. You are now inside the weapons depot. This is the second phase of the plan to gain access to sets underwater safe keep. In this munition stocks there is a cargo train. The train is packed full. Small arms, artillery shells, torpedoes and such for distribution to the Nazi war machine. You will steal this train. Small arms we can use to strengthen our fighters, but the real target is securing the torpedo delivery. This will allow you to board and seize control of a Nazi U-boat. But first things first, steal the train. Gotcha, ma'am. Locate the train and drive it to the abandoned underground train station north of there. Our people will be waiting for you at the station. Klaus will give you further details on the ground. Tesla upgrade. This unit alters the beam's frequency to affect any mechanical targets close to its path. Ah. Oh. Like robots? I thought this was already good for robots, so now it's doubly good? Hmm, they're giving me a lot of armor. Makes me wary. Okay. Yes, that's right. We can cut a hole here. Or do that. No. <laughs> no. There we go. Just in case. Suddenly, it's like we're in the underground tunnels of Moscow. May 29th, 1941. The Nazi appears to have been brought up lazy. I've learned this when I outran three of them carrying a crate of grenades. I think I'm pregnant. I wish I knew how to use a gun. 
And that just makes you think all kinds of bad things about what that pregnancy is from. We have a map, and we know where they are. Let's look around after we deal with the people here. Can I stay underneath? Without being seen, I mean? What's that? Oh, someone right there. Is that the commander, though? No, it's a random dude. Get him anyway? Oh, he's right above me, isn't he? One meter. Bunch of stuff. Again, get the guy first. There should be more people here than just- Oh, oh, here's my chance. Camp hunt. I have to stealth kill it, right? So is it okay with a... Melee or ranged? Melee or ranged. Frick! Oh, you must be joking me! That was such a good chance. Forgot I account for gravity yet again. Did someone notice me? Maybe in the control room. I don't see anybody though. Ooh. Oh, there was a person behind the pillar just now. Nothing here. Hey! Be quiet. Be very quiet. Or, you know what? The commander's gone, so I'm not afraid of you guys. You guys just want to come over or something? Maybe not. Okay. Oh! It's right there. How do I get it? Was that the only guy here? Really? Another one? Uh huh. Gosh, I can't believe I didn't get that stealth camp hunt kill. What a waste. What a waste. That was a really important upgrade, too. Walking faster while crouching. That one. God dang it. Is it possible for us to go upstairs? Uh, maybe not this way. Another way? Somewhere else? Yeah, something is in that control room. Oh, hello! Ow, ow! Whoa! Whoa! Hold on. Where are you? <laughs> You're never on the right setting. Whoo! Soup. 
Super Soldaten, 1960. Several generations later, the Super Soldaten have evolved into the state-of-the-art war machines. Their engineered bodies are covered by a shiny layer of titanium steel alloy, and they usually wield super laser cannons. Huh. Human? I guess? I guess? Could be AI. No! Your legs! No, it's a- it's AI. It's a robot. Now that I have this gun... <laughs> Could we open this and get inside, or...? Supplies. Okay. Aw, uh, do we have to worry about that closing? No. We're fine. Don't quite need the overcharged health, but the other supplies are welcome. Shotgun! Good, good. More weapons. Mm hmm. Where are we in the grand scheme of things? Armor? Yeah, so these are old tunnels, but there were commanders here, so I don't think it's completely unused. Tunnel here. Knives. Ah, that's probably how we open that area or something. Do we want to try checking what this is? Maybe it's an alternate way to get up here. Or get down, get down. Ah, this was the, the way where the, the shotgun was. Mm -hmm. Not a letter. Our ground team is in position by the abandoned train station north of your location, William. They will meet you when you get there. Okay. Sounds good to me. Is someone here? Oh! Ooh, these guys are quite armored, huh? How many shots they're taking? Holy crap. Ow! We're fine. We're fine. Y'all coming down here? Oh, but I can't get back over there. Okay. Was that it? Pretty much. Pretty much. Hmm? Nope. That's not it. Yeah. Oh, it's another big guy. Oh, I didn't recharge, but there's a station right here. Miraculously. We just happened to be sitting right next to it. Holy crap. Whoa! Whoa, there's an even bigger one. Mm, I gotta watch my health a little bit. Oh! 
like a lot. I know there's a lot of health around here, but I don't see any right now. You might have to walk around a little bit, be a bit more careful. Knife here. Okay. Okay. Someone's coming. We can't be caught in here. No. There is a um, battery thing. Don't get closed off here, though, because that's the end. Oh! Getting hit. Are we alright? Uh, our health is not good. No, I can't. There's gotta be more around here somewhere. Oh, not the gun! I didn't mean to pick up the gun. But this might be okay. No, it won't be! No, that weapon was slowing me down too much. I thought it was a health kit. I'm down to this last guy again, and I have very low health. I think our health comes back if we don't get damaged too much though. Like if we drop down to 81 health, then we can still regenerate back to 100 automatically without taking any health items. I think we really have to take advantage of this fact here. There are no more health items around. Don't let our guard down. It's kind of far away though. Don't let the health drop. Okay, no. Uh-oh. It's below 20. See, now I won't go back up to 40 anymore. I don't know where we can find more health. I'm too scared to wander around too much. And I'm not picking up that weapon again. No! No, 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 no. Seriously, no. I walk way too slow with it. Am I even aiming in the right place? Please. Calm down, more accurate shots maybe? Oh my gosh. <laughs> this is so turtley. There's nothing else I can do. It's too dangerous to do anything else. Is he dead? Oh, I think so. Let's be a little bit careful still though. Please. Oh, health, thank you. Woo! That was... That was something else. Well, we did it. Kind of. <laughs> kind of. Whatever, what's matter is that we did it in the end, and we're still alive. This weapon is a little too slow, I think. It makes us walk too slow. I would really love to have a little bit more health going into whatever else we're going to next, if that's possible, but I really don't remember where there's health. There might not be any more around here. That's the card. What about this? Okay, what about that? Oh, frick, man! Make a circle! Thank you. Yeah, this area, I couldn't access at all because the guys were kind of blocking it. I was too scared to walk over here, but there is a decent bit of supplies. I'm looking for health. <laughs> they keep giving me armor. I want health.
Thank you, thank you. Okay, well, we should be okay now. 